So you can take rainwater, harvest it, you'll store it in this big tank, yep. and then use it to uh, flush toilets and do laundry. Yep. Cool. How many gallons will this hold? This is just around 4,000. That'll be enough water for all of Jason and Holly's non-drinking needs. Now, to make this useful, we have to make it waterproof. Right. And that's me. That's where you come in. <laughs> now, first, we need to strip loose the framing supports to get to the walls. Yeah. We lose Jason. He ran away. I'm right here. Goop in the hole. Goop in the hole. It doesn't fit with you. It doesn't, body. It doesn't fit with me. And then the fun part. This is the same goo painted on the foundation walls. It looks awful. It looks disgusting. It's, it's actually it's not. It's actually not bad at all. It is a water-based, rubberized asphalt. It's very, very environmentally friendly. We're using it in a cistern. Um, it's approved for um, water reservoirs. It's eco-friendly because it releases no pollutants back into the air or water. We'll roll some out here. This is one coat. Yeah. See where the large gaps show up? Jason will come back and, and foam those. I like this. And I like what I'm hearing here. I'm coming away with homework. <laughs> <laughs> is this cistern going to pay off? You spent a bunch of money for it. You don't even know I don't how even much. know how much yet. No. Um, I'm not calculating it in terms of payback. Uh, I don't. I'm not counting the number of years that I'll have my money back by the water yeah. savings. This one's about having a thing that makes sense to me. Right. You know, rain, collect it, use it. 